Hello everyone, welcome to Review Infinite, the best product review channel on YouTube today. Today we're here again with another list of 5 best products on the market. These reviews are based on thousands of customer reviews and positive ratings. So let's make a list of best products in this video. 5 Best Band Saw Reviews Number 5 Skill 338601 Attached cast, iron base of the skill band makes it stable. You can quickly clean out the dust by the attached dust port. With the rack and pinion table you can get the desired height and the angle. Brand, skill, weight, 36 pounds. Model, 3386. 01 color red dimension 31.1 into 16.2 into 12.8 inches check the product price below number 4 when 3962 Building a 60 square inch box with up to 12 inches of storage capacity? Of course you are! Today I'm going to show you how to make a bandsaw box using the WEN 2 speed 10 inch bandsaw with stand and work light. We will also briefly be employing the help of the WEN 12 and a half inch thickness planer and the WEN variable speed oscillating tool. I started off by looking up other people's designs for bandsaw boxes online. Everyone else online demonstrated such creativity and showmanship with their bandsaw boxes, I couldn't wait to get started making my own version. First, I had to make a block of wood to construct the bandsaw box from. Because the Wind 2 speed 10 inch bandsaw has the ability to cut depths of up to 6 inches, I decided to make a 10 by 6 by 6 inch block of wood as my starting point. If this is the size that sounds right to you, then grab 4 2 by 6s to construct your own wooden block. Next, while donning your favorite business casual, plane off both faces of the boards so they are nice and flat. After that, glue the faces of the boards to one another with liberal amounts of glue to make sure the entire face gets covered. Finally, clamp the boards tightly to one another and leave them overnight to dry. Once the boards are nice and dry, use the wind bandsaw to cut the slab into 10 inch segments. Now you have a nice 6x6x10 by by inch block of wood to work with. Next, draw or glue on the design that you want to cut out. For me, I chose a design that would be next to impossible to mess up. After quickly messing up my design, I decided to revise my plans to something even easier. A half circle. A few things for beginners to consider. First and foremost, understand the relationship between the width of the blade and the turning radius of the saw. If you don't think your saw blade is turning sharp enough, then you may need a thinner blade. Once you have cut out the box, the next step is to cut a flat piece off the back. Set this piece aside, as you will need to be gluing it back on at a later point in time. After that, it's time to cut out your drawer. For mine, I chose to slice off the bottom of the slab in order to have easy access to cutting out my drawer. To make your drawer, cut out a solid piece from the center of the block. Perfect! Next, set aside the rest of your bandsaw box and cut off flat pieces from both the front and back of your drawer. Finally, cut the center out of the drawer to allow for room to put stuff. Now it's time to glue everything back together. You should have three pieces for your drawer, the front, the back, and the base. Go ahead and use wood glue and clamps to put these back together, leaving out the middle piece in order to leave room for stuff inside your drawer. After that, glue the other components of your bandsaw box together. Clamp them and leave them to dry separately from the inside drawer piece. Once the pieces have had time to dry, unclamp them and then see if your drawer fits. Odds are, it'll take a little sanding in order to get it to the right size. I used the wind variable speed oscillating tool with a low grit sandpaper in order to remove the excess material. After a bit of sanding, the drawer should slide perfectly back into your bandsaw box. Finally, using the excess scrap, make a little handle for your drawer. Carve out the handle with the bandsaw and then glue it to the front of your bandsaw box. 
Look at that cute little guy. Once the handle has a chance to dry, your bandsaw box is complete. And there you have it. Now you have a place to store all of your hopes and dreams, and maybe even a deck of cards. So remember, when you need a simple woodworking project idea, remember when. The when. 3, 9, 6, 2 has a 3.5 amp motor that can effortlessly produce either 1520 or 2620 FPM. Measuring guide equipped with the saw helps to cut precisely. You can make an angle cut with its table with bevel. Brand, when? Weight, 73 pounds. Model, 3962. Color, black. Dimension, 20 and 225 and 258 inches. Check the product price below. Number 3 DeWalt DCS 374P2 Variable speed trigger also helps you during your cutting operation. You can quickly change the blade without the help of any further key. The onboard 20 amp battery of the DeWalt can serve massive power for the intense work. Brand, DeWalt. Weight, 25 pounds. Model, DCS374 P2. Color, black and yellow. Dimension, 22.1 in 27.9 in 217.8 inches. Check the product price below. Number 2. Grizzly, G, 0, 5, 5, 5, L, X. The wheels are made of aluminum and are computer balanced for a smooth operation. They also run on heavy-duty ball bearings. This saw features a quick-release system for changing out the blades. I'll show you how easy it is to change the blades on this machine. First, disconnect the machine from the wall power outlet. Then all you have to do is flip this lever up, open the upper and lower wheel covers, remove the table insert, slide the blade out and replace it with the new one. Line up the new blade on the two wheels and through the guides. Flip the quick release lever back down and the blade is tight again. Glide the upper wheel slowly by hand to make sure the blade is properly aligned on the wheels and the blade guides. Shut both the upper and lower doors. Replace the table insert. Plug the cord back into the outlet and you're back in business. Blade tension is adjusted using the knob on the top of the bandsaw, right here. The saw also features a gauge that's calibrated for different blade widths. 
The quick release blade tension lever allows you to quickly release the blade tension when not in use to maximize blade life and then retension the blade again when needed. Blade tracking is quick and easy using the knob located on the back of the bandsaw. This saw features ball bearing blade guides with fine adjustments and these support the blade both where the cut is being made above the table as well as below. The body of the saw is made of solid cast iron and the stand made of heavy gauge steel. This helps dampen vibration. Watch how smoothly the saw is when I turn it on. The heavy duty table is made of cast iron and precision ground for smoothness and a great finish. The machine also comes complete with a miter gauge and a locking fence. A quick flip of the handle and the fence locks in place at the desired location. The fence also lifts off the table when not needed and has a magnified cursor for measurement. The table also tilts 45 degrees to the right and 10 degrees to the left. The floor to table height on this saw is a comfortable 43 and 5 16 of an inch. The shipping weight of this saw is approximately 198 pounds and it comes to you nicely packed. In case you're going to pick this saw up at one of our locations, let's measure the case. And a computer balanced cast iron wheels. Cast iron fence with large removable resaw fence. Heavy duty double ball bearing blade guides. Precision ground cast iron table that measures 19 and 3 quarters by 14 and 3 16 by 1 and a half inches. And it comes with a larger miter gauge. And the blade speed is 3,000 feet per minute. The solid cabinet stand has a front opening door with storage shelves inside for extra blades and tools. A quick release blade tension and a heavy duty two horsepower motor that's pre-wired to 220 volts. And the packing measurements of this saw are, this saw is a real cherry. Now all the saws we've featured here today are powder coated to ensure a scratch resistant and long lasting finish. And all have four inch dust ports to hook your dust collection hose right up to. The entire Grizzly is made from heave duty cast iron for durability. The one horsepower single phase motor can produce 1725 RPM. For the smooth operation, the saw uses the ball bearing system with its table. Brand, Grizzly. Weight, 251 pounds. Model, G0555LX. Color, white. Dimension, 45 in 221.5 in 218 inches. Check the product price below. Number 1. Jet, JWBS. 140 XPRO Drive system made from poly V belt with two speed always provides you the working satisfaction. The jet made their band saw with high quality casting for its longevity. The work table can tilt 10 to 45 degrees that can make various angles cut. Grand, Jet. Weight, 258 pounds. Horsepower, 1.25 HP. Color, white. Dimension, 29 in 228 in 277 inches. Check the product price below. All the products are available on Amazon and we listed down their Amazon links in the description. Check them out to know which one is best suited to your needs. That's all for today guys. Thanks for watching it till the end. Hope you liked it and all your confusions have been cleared up. If so, then go and give a thumbs up. If you are new, consider subscribing to our channel for our future video notifications. We review all sorts of products based on our audience demand to make your decision easier. Please let us know which product you owned from the list and why. Also, let us know if we missed any of your favorite products which deserve to be here.
Put the name of your products that you want to be reviewed by us in the comment section below. As always, we put the links of these mentioned products in the description below. Check them out for their best prices and details. We are not permitted to mention the prices in this video. So, cheers with the best one!